Parker, great. I want to do some test shots, and I've already given a car. Can you help me out? Yeah. Yeah, okay. You leaving? Yeah, sorry. This job's kind of, kind of my number one priority right now. Right. Supermodel over here. We'll hang out soon. This is a setup, isn't it? Poor Janet, let's fix her. You don't need to be fixed. According to our daughter, I do. Hey, Brad's not blowing smoke, honey. He's making you a legitimate offer. Okay, hey, even if I did feel sorry for you, which I don't, because there's no reason to, I'm not gonna compromise my job. All right, you were good on the show before. When you're on, you know, when I talk to Kim about it, she thinks you're great. All right, so, I need, okay, if you don't say yes, there is no show. Why not? Because Kim has this insane idea in her head that I need to be a part of a team and since Katie can't work, you know, the show's on hiatus until she pops or I find someone that's good enough to pinch hit for her, which is you. You've been saving my butt. Come on, honey, you can do this. You just have to believe in yourself as much as everyone else does. Well, I mean, I, I, I loved being on TV before and... And there's a lot that I would like to teach people about food. Well, the crew is still talking about your lasagna, and they're all out of work. So if you don't say yes, then there's no show. It's kind of beyond my wildest dreams. Then do it. We need you. The people, they need you. <laughs> do you think I could do Oh, in a heartbeat. Babe, in a heartbeat. Okay. Okay? Okay. Okay. Okay! okay. okay. before my meeting, and I'm so glad he did, too. It turned out to be the best thing that could have happened. I got caught up in the hype, and I'm so glad you opened up my eyes to what's really, really important. He's so committed to those kids, and he's not even related to them. It's really remarkable. That's one word for it. After he told me how he felt, I couldn't let him down. Let you down. I should get dinner started. I'm gonna... Well, I hate to say I told you so, but I told you so. Svengali strikes. I explained the situation to her simply and honestly. That's all. Really? Where'd you learn to do that? I know. And it worked. Go figure. Hmm. Well, what do you want from me? A Nobel Peace Prize? You know, I wonder if you could stop being a sourpuss just long enough to appreciate what I did. I mean, just this one time. Why? Why do you need adoration from me, Craig, when you have Terry, your number one fan? Hi, um, yes, this is Audrey Coleman. You, you remember I came in a little bit earlier about those uh, DNA tests? Yes, I'm, I'm so sorry I had to run out, but as you could probably notice, my friend is pregnant and she was about to lose her lunch, you know, and I think you clean that stuff up all day, so I didn't think you wanted to do that. So anyway, I had to leave, but she's fine. Could you, could you maybe give me the results of those DNA tests over the phone? It's not really protocol. Oh, but I promise, swear, 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 I wouldn't tell anyone. The two samples you provided were a genetic match. So, thank you. I knew it. It's open. Bubbles, thank God you're still home. I'm always home. What's going on? It's utter uh, mayhem. It's worse than I originally thought. What is? My mother, the psychotic killer. I think she's struck again. Oh, stop it, Henry. This is nuts. I know, I know. It's totally nuts. No, you're nuts. I just saw your mother a little while ago. She is not a killer. She's very sweet. Do not, do not let her fool you, okay? I, 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 just, I just had a drink with her latest beau. That's nice. No, it's not. Audrey introduced him as Jay Stanhope. Only problem is, that's not really his name. Underneath Mr. Stanhope lurks Raymond Zuma. So? So, so obviously, if Raymond is going around masquerading as Jay, then the real Jay is either missing or dead. Do you have proof of that? No, not yet. But you're gonna help me get some. On the next As the World Turns. If Adam was still alive, would you try and get the charges against him dropped? I, I need some help in here! What on earth happened? 
Are you absolutely 100% sure that my grandfather told you to give that much medication over him? I have dedicated my life to protecting you, and I am not about to let the likes of Emily Stewart dig her claws into you again.